What's going on, y'all? Welcome back to Big Bro and Lil Sis Reacts. I'm Tamaj and this is Tan. And today we are on Superman and Lois, Season 2, Episode 4, The Inverse Method. Um, last we left off, we discovered what was in the mines. We thought it was Doomsday, but it was actually Bizarro. How he got here, who's behind all this, we don't know. We know the one girl was working to dig him out, but she's working for somebody. I don't know who. Um, Lois went to go meet her sister, but then the cult lady popped up. So that means Lana... What's, what's her name? No, Lucy. Lucy is back with the cult lady who is trying to, you know, discredit her and ruin her name. So we'll see what happens with that. Jonathan went to buy this ex kryptonite um, to get stronger. But again, we don't know what kind of side effects that's going to have because he is actually Kryptonian, unlike the other guy who's human. Yeah. yeah. So um, then who else we got? Jordan. What was he doing last episode? I don't even remember what Jordan was doing. Nothing. Wasn't he probably doing something with Sarah? I don't even know what Jordan was doing. Um, Natalie, I believe she was going to help her father fix up the soup. She wasn't too happy that, um, you know, he was out there with it. But she's like, you know what? If you're going to do this, I'm going to make sure you out there and I'm going to get you right. So she's going to fix up the soup for him. Um, she's, you know, continuing to bond with the family. Um, I think Jordan was just with Sarah and they were fixing their relationship, if I remember correctly. But that's about it. And Lana is still running for mayor. So we're going to see what they got for us this week. Full and early reactions are available on Patreon. Yeah. Oh, here, here Lucy go. She Who? finally popped up. Uh, Lois' sister. This was five years ago. I made burgers. What are you doing? I can't stay here anymore, Lois. It's not that I don't appreciate you taking me in because I do. But it's too much. Being around your perfect family and your perfect life... I know you're trying to help me, but staying here for the past few months has only made things worse for me. I have to build my own life, and I need to be around people who understand me and know what I'm going through. Are you staying with Allie for a while? Yes. Only until I can afford to get my own place. I can't let you do that. Well, that's not your decision to make. Allie is my friend. She is a parasite. She leeches onto people when they are at their lowest and convinces them that she's the only one who can fix them. I'm not having this conversation again. Lucy, you're just having a hard time right, right now. I've been having a hard time my whole life. I have lost everything. My job, my fiance, mom. Hmm. Why can't you see that? I see you. I see you. But you can't help me. And Allie can't. Crisis has not been good she to her. Her has. life here ain't that good. Where's my sister, Allie? She didn't want to see you. You mean you wouldn't allow her to see me? Are you afraid I might get through to her? No, that's not the issue. I don't force any of my congregants to do anything they don't want to do. Mm -hmm. Congregants? So the inverse society is a religion, then? Call it whatever you like. How about a cult? <laughs> We're a group of willing individuals on a journey towards completion. I am simply leading the way. You're a folk hero for the misguided, brainwashing, weak-minded people into believing that you're the only one who can make them whole. Call her out on her shit, Lois. She's weak-minded. She was in pain and you exploited that pain. Now she's a shell of who she once was. She's broken and broke, withdrawn from her friends and family. Not all of her family. Lucy calls your father regularly. My father didn't have to pull Lucy out of a bathtub and bring her back to life. I did. Lucy wasn't dying. She was ascending to another plane, like Heather Ackerman. I would have beat her ass. It was an isolated incident. She died because of you. She had a heart condition that she didn't disclose to anybody. You should be in prison for the rest of your life. And you certainly tried to make that happen, didn't you? Now so I'm gonna go to jail, bitch, because you got me fucked up. Only for a while. I'm talking about you. I suggest same. you listen to our podcast tomorrow morning. Who knows, after the world hears what Lucy has to say, maybe you'll be the one who's canceled. Whatever I have to do, I am going to make sure that Lucy and everyone else you have infected sees you for the absolute fraud that you are. And then I'm going to take you down once and for all. <laughs> they say, yeah, fuck it, we giving Lois her own villain this season. Oh! What y'all going to do? I don't respond well to threats, Lois. Let her click that BLT. It's over for all y'all motherfuckers. BLT. <laughs> they better stop playing with her. Yeah, I don't want to help with smoke. 
But I like how she had folks playing in here. She knew, cause she knew she had a chance to get her ass beat. She's about two seconds away. Lois, everything okay? No, you were right. We need to find my sister. I wish the fuck somebody would call me, say something, and hang up on me. Like, wait, I'm about to call back. Like, what happened? And where did she go at? I don't know what the fuck he's doing. That look like a. Was that a diamond? Look like a clip so. But what is he holding? Maybe he's hiding in his vision because you can't be two supermen. They're connected somehow. Because it wasn't like this for Kara when she fought the Laurel girl. So Lucy was the mysterious source. Recanted a lot of her story. Said I broke her trust. Acted unethically and selectively edited a lot of what she told me to push a personal agenda against Allie. She's gone, Clark. So find a way to bring her back. As if it's that simple. I actually wanted to talk to you. Some people were in here earlier asking me questions. What kind of questions? Secrets in the closet kind. Dean, trying I think to get he's trying to dig up your past mm -hmm. and use it against you. Trying to get some dirt. That's nice politics. You're asking about Sarah too. I'm so sorry. I just I have to tell you. No, um, I appreciate it, Emily. Thank you. Okay, anytime. She's gonna have to get dirty. You want to play the, the, the long game? Uh, We're gonna play the long game. Quiet like this. Yeah, that's how politics work, though. Like Get out of his field, He's on his way. He's coming. Now what? Oh, this motherfucker pulled up. He flew up. I mean, you're welcome to try diplomacy, but I don't think it's gonna work. Don't destroy house. I was about to say, damn. I don't think we can afford to. What, what is that? He's trying to suck him into that. He's trying to resist getting pulled in. Come on, Thor. Shit. He ran. He showed him run last time. Okay. Where the real creepers hang out, which is where I have been catfishing all night using probably my best alias. She's a young, impressionable blonde from Iowa City struggling to find herself. Screams victim. Exactly. And like sad masculine clockwork, I got hundreds of messages, most of which need to be forwarded to law enforcement. But <laughs> there was also this invite. Please join Allie Alston as she discusses humanity's incompleteness and how we can ascend so ourselves. So you want to cover. Invite only just a couple of hours from here in New Carthage. I say, come on, Penny. I'll drive. I got some new respect for her for doing that. Mm-hmm. And she didn't start it off. I swear next to you, I see him on a pummel like son of a bitch. Kyle, shouldn't you just forget about Mayor Dean for just one second? So what are we gonna do about drink. Sarah? Fuck this. She doesn't deserve this. Of course not. But don't you think she should know that Dean is out there asking about her incident? We don't know what he knows. If something does come out, don't you think it's better for her to be prepared? Yeah. What about Dean's kid, huh? I mean, from what I hear is about a half an eight ball away from being an Escobar. <laughs> Maybe we uh, do a little digging of our own, huh? No, no. We don't go after family members. That is a line I refuse to cross. She is stronger than you think. At least they're being you know, honest. Dad basically put and Jordan got her back. Has in that store, so it really means a lot to them. Well, then, how about you pick up anything you want and I'm buying? It's a grocery store, not Saks Fifth Avenue, but thanks. Are there any of that yellow mist yet? <laughs> um, no. It's it's a, it don't matter. It's like 10 in the morning. Might make the rest of the day more interesting. So no. What exactly does this stuff do? Like, really? Besides make you feel like Superman? I don't know. It's different for everyone. I mainly feel stronger, but my Kendall took it. She swears she heard her mom at work a couple miles away. Isn't that crazy? Uh, yeah, I know. I guess that's crazy. It's just like, um, I, don't, I don't really know if it's my thing. Right, exactly. Yeah, no pressure, but 
Just so you know, Timmy, he bought like five inhalers on Saturday, so. Fuck Timmy. He might be pretty tough to beat without some help. Now you're pressuring. Love you, Jay. You just like that, no pressure. Do what you feel right. That's how you, you know, they do in high school, peer pressure at its finest. That thing he wears around his neck that seems to glow when you got close to him, has a very specific energy signature, which we now have. I'm afraid the DOD is the only one with satellites that can find something like that. I'll take it down. Wait, 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 there's one other thing. Look, um, you already know what you're saying. The hammer's cracked. So when you get a hit, I can take it from here. No. Park, you can't. Not alone. You're saying you need but to wait. I saw what that thing did to you with the mines. Or are you trying it's to say powerful. he needs a other super? You people. need help. And there's probably nobody better to ask than Anderson and that team of his. So what if Anderson's playing double, double max? Wow, this place is amazing. We ain't gonna know. Yeah, so awesome. Thank you, school cards. All of my dad money improved. So is is this why you're not doing cheer anymore? Yeah, pretty much. Clean out your jacket. Let's get out of here. Not you about to <laughs> stop your first crime. Nothing happens here that we don't see. This is why we don't use our powers in public. God damn. See, trying to do good and save the day, and he done fucked up. I know his heart being out here since he's black here. Why and how are you using your cold breath in a quickie mark? Uh, some guys were just trying to steal some booze, and my friend Denise's family just opened up the store with the already, and then I was just trying to help. You did a noble thing. Dumb as hell. Yeah. Do you need to do something? You're gonna look at the video like any second. You mean the video I just sent you? Granddad already on it. That's the fuck I'm talking about. How did you, son? They used to run the United States Department of Defense. Cleaning this up is easier than Candy Crush. Thanks for doing that so fast. I'll always help out family. You're gonna not plan the round in my life. I'm glad they resolved that because I was stressed for a second. Are you ready for this? I would thought I definitely didn't teach under cover cult demonstration at my journals in school. I'll go in there and No, you get recognized in a second. I can do this. All right, just go in there. Look for my sister. If you see her, text me. I bet you've looked for this key to happiness in religion. Nor maybe philosophy. Maybe on a walk in nature, or just watching the big football game at home. That would scare the shit out of me. You cannot interfere no, no, no. with my objectives. I, I had to. There's a chain of command around here. Superman and Sam Lane isn't part of it anymore. I needed some help. Then call me. Let me help you with whatever that thing was that the mines that attacked Well, that's why I'm here. That's why I'm here. What's that? It's a way to track that thing. But we need to use the DOD satellites. Where'd you get it? A friend. Can't steal soon. We'll see what we can find. You find it, you let me know. I saw what that thing did to you. You have no condition to stop anything. Your team isn't ready, General. I have to do this alone, so please, just let me know. Or I said, take it back. Don't Come on, don't do it now. Yeah. In front, and not, oh, no, open either. You don't even know what it's going to do to you. You're supposed to test it out at home or something, like, or away. Oh, God. Seems like just enhanced sight so far. Hey, Coach. Do you mind if I was talking about Timmy for a second? I've already made my decision on who started. Oh, no, 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 it's not about that. It's just, um... Seeing the way that, that Timmy's been bettering himself and improving, and I just I wanna I wanna push myself the same way. So if there's a chance to get any throws in, I'd really appreciate it. So that's what I was looking for, Tim. He's like, now I see how he's been doing it. What are you doing here? We need to talk. No, you feel the need to talk. I never need to talk to you again. Lucy. Oh. 
five minutes. Please, it's the least you could do for me after you sent Allie to meet me instead of you. Fine. Room 452. Why now, Lucy, why recant after all this time? Because Allie's calling is too important to allow you to interfere again. Your article ruined my life. That wasn't my intention and you know it. It was directed at Allie. It doesn't matter. It she happened. didn't even mention her. I was just trying to get my little sister back safely. I'm never coming back. Perhaps the biggest hole is the one left from betrayal. Once the person who deceived us gets away with it, that pain never goes away. Isn't that right, Miss Beppo? She knew. Mm -hmm. Please she's don't gonna, be nervous. Don't do nothing to her. I'm glad you're here. Even if it is under false pretenses. It's not easy getting an invite to one of your brainwashing sessions. So you lied. Seems you really do take after your mentor. Where is this anger coming from? You drove mom away. I was eight. You do not get to blame me for her leaving. You wouldn't yeah. even talk about her after she left. It was like she never even existed for you. She, because she abandoned us. us. She was still our mom. Not to me. Not after that. You can't make the truth disappear, Lois. Even if you don't like it. It's not what I did. Yes, it is. With mom, with me, with Allie. You hide the truth to fit your own special narrative. Lois Lane is the best reporter I've ever met. You should meet more reporters. I already met the best. I don't need to meet nobody else. I'm not here to humiliate you, Miss Beppo. I just want you to know the truth. That you're like next level banana pants crazy? I understand your confusion, but maybe this will help change your mind. Your article on Allie wasn't what we agreed on. You intentionally left out a this key part of the this story. What are you talking about? I saw my other self. You were overdosing. I was connecting. Just like Allie said, everything she promised me happened. And when I told you about it, you ignored it. It wasn't important to the story. That was the story. It's why I took the pills. To cross over. You weren't in a right state of mind. That is not for you to decide. Why didn't you publish what I saw? Because I was trying to protect you. You sounded insane. You were lost. And Allie Alston convinced you to almost kill yourself. No, she didn't. And you didn't believe me because you didn't want to believe me. Allie was right, and you know it. She's a monster. Sounds like bias to me. Text her. You're recording. She's recording. I know that was not easy to hear, Christine. But maybe it's time to reconsider what you believe. Fuck no. That's, That's all I need. What are you doing? Really about to it's amazing what we can I'm put spy cameras in nowadays. You recorded me? I just wanted everything on the record this time. Something to make sure you keep away from us. You can't even beat the bitch ass because they record you. Stay out of my life, Lois. Anything else I should know about? You heard that? Yeah, I heard. Allie broadcasted for the whole room to see. A lot more to this article than you first let me believe. You really don't trust me, do you? Chrissy, I can explain. What? No, not right now. Hey, <sighs> Lois, they playing dirty. We found out that Mayor Dean isn't just looking into my past, but he's looking into yours too. I needed help and I didn't really know how to ask for it, but I am not gonna let anyone make me feel ashamed for it. I, I made a mistake and I learned from it. Shouldn't that be a good thing? Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So if that ignorant loser wants to attack me, then fine, let him. I, you know, I'd love to get up on that debate stage and tell everybody what I think about the country fried ass. <laughs> 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 I, that that is. I still want a rematch, by the way. Okay. Something good has happened today. Stuff. This episode's been nothing but stress. Like, what do we do to deserve this? Here we go. What are you doing? I thought that bird was gonna hit me. That bird way over there? No one's ever gonna believe a word I say if Ali goes public without recording. Babe, you don't know that for sure yet. Chrissy doesn't, and she's my partner. She'll come around. And when she does, the two of you will figure out how to fix this. Tried to get over there today. I honestly thought that I could save her. 
So stupid. My mom always said it's never stupid to try to help someone. But if they don't want to help, then what do you do? Sir, we have a hit in Bolivia. It's really nothing, nothing you Bolivia. can do. It's, it's hard. You sure it's the same energy signature? Yes, sir. So Here he go. Fun. I'm tired We're of this episode. Sure, we don't need to alert Superman, sir. It's all the decision it's making for me today. Yeah, they're about to get killed. Yeah. I can't wait to see his reaction. Maybe. I hope not. Because this thing has Superman's face. And if Clark don't stand a chance, then they don't. And they don't even know about this thing. We don't know what it does. It tried to suck Clark in, so if it sucks them in, he could get stronger. Not the Superman of America. Like, what is it? Hmm. Anderson's in his team to stop this guy. Can they? Two are already dead. Snap their necks. Lost. Here's help, right? <laughs> no, he's going to help to help. <laughs> No, your suit's not ready. I don't want you to get hurt too. Your arms up. Bizarro out here snapping necks. <laughs> Please. The only one left alive. Okay, he dropped the necklace. Good. That other dude better leave it though. Leave it. I can't stand people. I really can't. This was not a good idea, bro. Turn around. You're a liability. Yeah. Trust we're overmating energy into the hammer. I don't leave you exposed. Do it. One thing about John Henry, he gonna throw that motherfucking hammer. Ooh. Damn. Toss his ass like a fucking what they call it, a stepping stone. <laughs> That motherfucker is bouncing on the ice. See, this is what I be talking about. Yeah. His spine all messed up. He's pissed. Woo! God damn! Is this still his face? Or... Damn! Beating the brakes off this motherfucker. He's trying to just feel good to let loose. And ain't nobody to hurt here. And if it's himself, then he can use 100%. Yeah. He uppercutted his ass. He almost did. That's why he I didn't want him to go. He threw that hammer and left. You do not have to. Well, he, he, know, a good day. he used all his power and, and put it in the hammer. Remember? I know. And as soon as he put that power in the hammer and threw it, he, he can't. The, pa the suit lost That's power. She's gonna be pissed. Because this shouldn't have happened. He shouldn't have went. So what happens when you try to be a hero. That's been the theme of today. <laughs> Everybody who's trying to be a hero and save somebody has been getting Superman. screwed over. Lois, the Superman of America. Jordan. He was alive. Oh, what just happened? Lois, let me go. Okay, just, just leave us alone. Team Super Family over here been getting nothing but L's today. It isn't my favorite public service. Hey, don't do nothing. You smug son of a bitch. Whoa, 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 I'm gonna be watching you. Well, that goes two ways, Kyle. For a man who likes his tequila neat, word around town is you should be getting messy with it. Now you're going after your past. Don't let him get in your head. That's just what he wants. Okay, you're sober now. That's all that matters. Sean, are you okay? He's breathing on his own again. 
Doctors will know more until the morning. I'm gonna need people to stop thinking they hey. can just rumble Bizarro. Uh, like, that is literally son? Superman. What's like, on your mind, son? Stop. The last time they were on this port, too, we got it. Oh, well, there's a superman with no humanity. It's happened like... recently. I... Yeah. I think I should be ready to help that. Um... Here we go, trying to be a hero play. again. It's too, it's too soon. Okay. But this stays between us. I knew he gonna try to train him secretly. Mm -hmm. Clark gonna be pissed because you did this behind his back when he find out, and he will find out because it's TV. Not you going to get a tequila neat. He been sneaking out. He's pretending to be sober. Bruh, obviously somebody in here talking, bruh. For real. Many of the boys sure have missed you around here. Oh, no, they're saying. But not nearly as much as I have. Oh. He was having an affair. That's actually uh, what I came here to talk to you about. He wasn't sneaking out because they said they missed him. He was having an affair. He was cheating. That's what he's afraid is going to come out. Chrissy, I'm sorry. Oh, my God. Are you Please call me back when you get a chance. This episode's a mess. Who wrote this shit? They said <laughs> fuck everybody. They pissed one of these writers off. Because all Ellie has done is hurt you and God knows how many other people, and I'm not gonna let her do it anymore. But, oh, they didn't what does that mean? It means I'm going to take her down. So let me get this straight. You love me as long as I do exactly what you say. No, but I will do anything to keep you safe, Lucy, because of how much I love you. Even if it means you hating me for the rest of your life, whatever I have to do to stop her, I will do it. Not even you can stop the truth from coming out. What truth? What? This episode's been all about truth. Girl, you don't pick up the phone. Because what you about to do? We ain't had like no good scenes. Oh, she's calling her back. Is she? Christine, I was hoping you'd call. Um, Can you meet me? I want you to tell me the truth about Lois. I never liked Christine from the beginning. I didn't care for her, but decent. hear me out. I don't care for her. But this could go two ways. Lois is her partner. So she 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 started this, right? This episode wanting to go undercover. She got exposed. So now what? This could be a part of her plan. Too. Exactly. You wanna if you wanna stay undercover, you gotta continue to play it off. So she's she knows they're being watched. So her having a fight out in the open with Lois. You know, and being genuine about it, making it feel genuine, could be a trick to get in deeper. If she's going to truly help Lois, she has to get in deeper. Mm -hmm. She has to seem like she's going behind Lois's back because that's the only way she's going to get close to Allie. That, that, otherwise, Allie has a one-up on Lois. And if her and Lois are trying to be a team, then she's going to have to really do this on her own and kind of leave Lois in the dark. So I'm going to give Chrissy, for now, the benefit of the doubt until I see otherwise. Because I've never really cared for her character, but this could be a turning point. This could be something her character can do good. Mm -hmm. But, you know, it can go both ways. I could be right, I could be wrong. So we're going to see it. But right now, I'm giving her the benefit of the doubt. Yeah, um, I just sort of liked her because she's always, you know, just being She flips. Her. She gets attitudes too quick. and yeah. mm, But... I'm going to give her the benefit of the doubt here. Lucy, yeah, that girl is broken. I don't know what crisis did to her. Because last we saw her, she, she had it all together. She had a life crisis for eight years now. Yes, yeah, since she lost James, she just went downhill. Mm. But um, glad they got that actress back, though, to keep it in-house. And, and, you know, they can change the character but because crisis happened. So that kind of helped, with, like, the shows reset their characters if they wanted to. That's, like, the only way that works, which is pretty cool. Um, but I'm interested to see more of this dynamic this season. I, like I said earlier, I like that they gave Lois her own villain. Some like, cause it's really hard for her to tackle the things Clark's dealing with because he's. They have to create a villain for Clark that's 
equal to his strength and Lois can't really help there. They they usually last, like last season kind of had her as like the damsel in distress. We don't want to keep doing that, so give her her own villain, give her her own storyline. I like yeah. it. I and like then it. Don't they didn't make it random too, like just mm -hmm. this random reporter. They had it made it have a connection to her. Which right, and we brought back a character yeah. we already kind of have a, a small history with. Um and then we got Clark over here. <laughs> He's going through the same thing, you know, he tried to trust the DOD and was like, you know, here, I'm gonna, I need y'all to do this for me. I understand, you know, that y'all watching me and whatever, and you don't, we're not seeing eye to eye, but I need your help here. He helped him, but then he tried to prove a point. Sent in his Superman of America, got two of them killed. Like Clark said, they're not ready. Now, I could have seen, okay, let me tell Clark when I'm sending my Superman after him to help him, maybe to show him that he can't do it alone. They might have been okay had they had Clark to back them up, but they went on on their own, not knowing what the threat was, which is one the number one problem with that. And then... If you're not a professional, don't go somewhere where you They think they are professionals. Like that. That's the problem. No. They, they What? They're not professionals like Superman. No, but they think they are. That's oh, what he, yeah. that's what they the do. dude from the DO Anders, Anthony Anderson, whatever Anderson. Anderson's hyping their head up like they're the shit right now, like they're replacement Superman mm -hmm. and they're not. So uh, hopefully this experience humbled him. That's the one scene I wanted. I wanted Clark to go back there and say something to him. But then the dude went and took the necklace, the necklace that uh, Bizarro was trying to look like suck him into. Um, so I don't know what's gonna happen with that. And Lois probably feels guilty because she was the one who told um what's it John name? Henry. John wherever she's setting out enough. Was. I mean I don't know if she necessarily feels guilty about it. She doesn't know necessarily about the suit. Um, um they don't really know what's going on with the suit. It's not like it, they had an open conversation about it. Lois been doing her own thing, but mm -hmm. um that was a decision John Henry made because regardless, I think John Henry was gonna go if Lois said anything or not. Um, but he knew the suit was, it had no functionality. It couldn't protect him. The first fight wiped his suit out. Like you had 10%, bro. And the hit, it helped Clark out, but you left yourself vulnerable. Now you messed up. And then Natalie's fears came true. So you really only hurt your daughter, you know, cause you know, she's cause scared. he could have put that at, what's it called? Uh, yeah, he could have put that, um, he like seven percent, and then he's got three percent, and then three left. Yeah, but John Henry ain't one to run from a fight, so I don't know. I just think it was a bad decision. He should have trusted that Clark would have been okay. Yeah. But the other side of that it is, if happen. something did ha happen to Clark, you know, he probably would have felt bad. But I mean, he's I don't know. Right. He's Superman. He's been doing this for a long time. At some point, you got to have some faith in him. You don't always need help, especially if you can't really help him. Like. I get some people don't like to just do nothing. Like they have, they feel like they have the urgency to help. Like they gotta do it no matter what. But he had, he should have thought about his daughter and how she was gonna feel and what could happen to him because she would have been an orphan. Like, no, they would adopt her then. Of course, but that's still an orphan. Like yeah. if you're being adopted, you're an orphan. So I just that situation sucked. This was a. Bad episode for our characters. Like I said, I don't know who pissed the writers off because they said fuck well, every character. Well, it was a good episode for Doran, but everybody else. He yeah, he he had a scare because he tried. He wants to be a hero now. He wants to help his dad out. But, oh yeah, I forgot that happened to Doran. Never mind. Everybody just. I don't but know. I mean, I think that was just to plant the seeds of him becoming Superboy. He's gonna be you know a hero. Um... I mean, I'm not opposed to him getting stronger. I just don't he's like just the too fact. Young. Yeah, I just don't like the fact that he's going behind his dad's back because I don't, that's just gonna blow up in everybody's he face. To the OG, if you wanna be able. He knows the hero. answer Clark's gonna give him, but, but Clark. Clark is open minded. He could be like, "Oh, when you're 17, you know, I'm gonna start, or I could start training you. But when you're but 17, you can start Clark. The field more. Clark, you we don't really know how Clark would have reacted because he didn't ask. Like when he, um, Clark was going to uh, with what's his name in the first episode, um, Morgan Edge, his brother, whatever. He um, brought Jordan with him. Jordan said, "Let me back you up," and he was like, "Okay, I'll let you come," you know, or whatever. Like. He is sometimes open-minded. Now, he's not going to be like, you can like... come to a fight with Bizarro with me, but, like, maybe they could have did some after-school practicing or something, yeah. you know, just honing like, and getting comfortable. Went... 
and been like, can you start training me? Maybe when I'm a senior, I can start going to the boat with you. Because mm. I feel like four years of training, that's good to start going to the boat. I mean, that's the whole thing with Jordan, though. He don't want to wait. He think he wants, it's like that sense of urgency of wanting to help now. Yeah. That's how everybody's feeling. Because Clark's a little vulnerable right now, so everybody wants to help him. But it's like, y'all are putting yourselves in danger because y'all are not invincible like Honestly, Clark is. Jordan picked the wrong time to do this because his father's already going through a lot. You could ask maybe three weeks from That's now. why he went to his grandfather. Yeah. He's like, because you know Clark can't do that right now. So it was either wait or ask grandfather. So grandfather said, I'm going to teach you. So we'll see how that all plays out. I mean, I think it, it'll still benefit Jordan. I think in the end, he'll still be stronger. But I just hope he doesn't, like, again, like kind of like how Anderson did to those kids, put them out there too soon. He doesn't go out there too soon and get hemmed up because of that. Yeah. Jonathan, on the other hand, he took these this X kryptonite. It, it's okay for now. It just gave him enhanced vision, but you see he kind of got that scare and that is looking like she was a little sus of him, but it, it's for it's now. But those, um, powers we have to keep taking it. It is. That's why he says Timmy had like five inhalers. So Jonathan has to keep taking that and the effects could start to get worse on his body because that's how drugs work. They start to... What in the world? I thought this so. was... You know, if you take one, you got it forever. No. Because it's it's just like an exposure to the drug. Like, it's not it's not oh, changing it's like, your body right away. It doesn't, oh, you know, it's just like giving you, like, the experience. It's just like tester. Yeah, your body will eventually, you know, factor all like that stuff they, out. When they advertise food in the store and they give you half a cracker instead of full cracker. But, um, it was a good episode. I mean... Uh, they're taking a three week break, so um, I think it comes back February 22nd. So that was a weird that they decided to give us a break, but it was kind of random. But it is what it is. Hey, we it, as long as they come back, back or they come back better than ever because this season so far has been killing it. They ain't been holding back no punches, like the action's been there, the drama. This episode was good, like, shit, it felt like a mid season finale to me, but they we still did. got plenty of episodes to go. So the, the writing is just amazing. Um, yeah, the writer this episode did not get out. No, so but I'm going on vacation. <laughs> I'm gonna leave this story. I'm good. <laughs> he was like, I'm getting that paycheck. Yeah. But uh, then we got Anyways. Lana. Lana, she about to find out her husband been cheating. Oh, I forgot about that. Oh my gosh. Rainy. Because I thought, you know, he convinced me he was loyal. Yeah, and then that's how politics is a dirty game. That's why he's been so defensive this episode. Mm -hmm. And then I think he probably... And why he was slamming... Uh, why he was opening drawers and slamming them. Mm -hmm. So he, he's mad because he knows this could possibly come out. He's like, I'm about to try to end it, but it's too late. Can you... Yeah, it's too hey. late. But yeah, that's going to break that family apart because cheating is one thing. That... And not only was he That's lying hard to forgive sometimes. Cheating. He was lying about being sober. No, no, no. He was sober. I thought he was lying about that no, at first. No, she passed him a, a shot. He didn't take it, though. Yeah. Because they, but... they said you ain't been here in a while. So that means he, he wasn't. But he was cheating. <sighs> but this season been good so far. It's So far, to me, it's top in season one so far. Even though season one was really I good. I'm, I'm loving it. I already know you got bad memory. You don't be remembering nothing. But um, oh, thank you guys for oh, watching. Thank you guys for watching. And of course, we want to hear what you guys thought. Be sure to like, comment, share, subscribe. Subscribe to Patreon for more. And we will see you guys for more Superman and Lois February 22nd. Bye.